it's incredible. So it's been, everybody's been there. So everybody's been jumping in and, you know, I, it's incredible. But all right. Well, 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 now that we're making that, like you said, to the next level going to pro, what is, you know, what have you guys been concentrating on? What have you been doing differently, you know, in this camp to prepare for longer rounds and professional roles? So basically, like like you're saying, is turning it up to longer rounds, more intense training, more more movement with elbows, more combinations of cage work and stuff like that. It's been kind of interesting. It's it's a whole different feel to it because it's not only the longer training rounds, but it's also like it, working with Tom has added a whole new mix to it too. So it's been interesting. Lauren Braccia, I mean, do you know anything about your opponent at all, or you don't even really care about watching film? Some people want to see every drop of film on their, their opponent. Other people really don't care. You know, what stance do you take on that? I actually am the kind of person that likes to study it. So what uh, I like to do is to research what they do and why they do what they're doing. So Lauren Braccia is a huge jujitsu person, which is kind of in my wheelhouse, which will be enjoyable to see. I think it would actually be exciting because her, uh, there's a couple matches where she's had several submissions. So it's going to be cool to watch where she had submission attempts, but they didn't lock in. So it'll be interesting to see how from line of working with Tom's jujitsu versus her, her jujitsu and how, what will, what is she going to plan to do? So it, it'll be interesting. She does a lot of takedowns, which are cool. So it's, I, it, I think it'll be an interesting matchup. Great, great. All right, Lauren, what do you say? You, you see this go in the distance. You, you know, you said she's jujitsu. Jiu -jitsu. Would you like to submit her, knock her out? Tell me a little bit how the fight plays out in your mind. Well, I don't like to play out too far in it because you never know what, what can happen. But um, either I assume that it's going to be a stand-up fight or for, like, it depends on who's going to, be able to take the upper hand here. So for her, she'd idealistically, you know, go for the ground game. But I'd really like to see how the stand-up will go. So it'll be Fantastic. interesting. Fantastic. Great. Well, it's great to talk to you, Mary. I will be we will be cage side covering the fight live. Your your fans can see it on Fight TV. Give out some shout outs or some love if you have any sponsors. And listen, the we just talked about the grind, how long it is and how much support you need to get where you're at now. So let those people know. Give out some some shout outs. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Um so Modifier Fitness with Tara Th uh, Thornton has been incredible. B uh, BS hot sauce and then Mena Web Agency, along with, um, yeah, that's a, they've been a lot of help along the way. So it's been, you know, a lot going forward. All right, Lauren, listen, best, best, Mary, best best of luck this week with your, uh, I'm not even talking to Lauren. I'm all frazzled. So many interviews this week. I apologize, Mary. Oh, no, you know, I really Best of luck this week with any final weight cuts and preparations. And uh, we will see you uh, in Atlantic City. And uh, best best of luck and best of skills to you. Thank you very much. Super excited. All right. Take care. All right. Take care.